Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about add and subtract fractions and mixed numbers, and we're going to evaluate each expression. So, if I was given these fractions, okay, negative 3 and 3 fifths minus 4 and 2 fifths, okay? All right. Well, since uh, we see the minus 4 and 2 fifths as a subtracting sign, and the first number is negative as well, we're adding basically two negative numbers. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to rewrite this for that plus a negative. Negative 3 and 3 fifths plus a negative 4 and 2 fifths. Okay? Well, since we're dealing all with negatives here, okay, and we have a, um, a mixed fraction here, what we can do is separate this up in a sense, okay? And so we have negative 3 plus a negative 3 fifths plus a negative 4 plus a negative 2 fifths. So we can kind of break that down like that. And what that allows us to do is really see what's going on here. Negative 3 and negative 4 together, right, we can add these two, these two together right here, and that becomes a negative 7. Right? And then we can add the negative 3 fifths and negative 2 fifths together, and that we can kind of group them together, and that becomes a, well, that's a negative 1, same denominator. If we add the numerators, it's negative 5 over 5, right? So negative 5 over 5, we know, is a negative 1. So negative 7 plus a negative 5 over 5, or a negative 1, is a negative 8. And so our final answer here is just negative 8. So quick recap, we're given negative 3 and 3 fifths minus 4 and 2 fifths, okay? So what I did here, okay, I made the negative or subtraction to be adding a negative. Then I broke them up, the whole numbers and the fractions. Now make sure when you do that, especially with a negative, okay, the negative also goes to the fraction part, the negative 2 fifths and the negative 3 fifths. It allows me to see, okay, that negative 4 and negative 7, or negative 3 and negative 4 adds me negative 7, and negative 3 fifths and negative 2 fifths were negative 5 fifths. Negative 5 fifths is the same thing as 1, or negative 1, so we have negative 7 plus a negative 1, which is a negative 8, so again, negative 8 is our final answer.